Okay, uh, in the last video, uh, what we did was we, we cut our uh, angled off end here, and then we also shortened the tube and then deburred them. Uh, so now the next step uh, in forming your, your chrome sleeve for your MHS Sabre is to, uh, well, with this style that I'm doing with this one anyway, we're going to cut a uh, window out here so that we can see the ribbed extension. And there's a couple ways that you can go about laying this out. Um, one way to do it would be to use a piece of graph paper and make yourself a pattern. Um, I could use this, but uh, it's seen quite a bit of use. I used this originally on Brass Sabers uh, number two and uh, six and seven, and then a few a uh, few other Chrome Sabers after that. So it's kind of worn out. I don't really like to use that anymore. Uh, so what I'm going to be doing with this one is just going to measure and lay it out with masking tape. Um, I'll start because we know this uh, extension here is a it's a five inch double female from the custom saber shop, so we'll just go from five inches from the bottom, and that'll give us our edge for here. And we'll just mark it. And so that I make sure that I have my tape in a nice straight line, I'm going to mark it off. several places even though we're going to consider this to be the top because of the angled cut so give me a few different reference points to make sure that the tape is on there in a straight line okay so now what we need to do is measure just how long we want that grip window to be usually it's right around three inches Just shy of three inches, actually. The ribs are about an eighth of an inch, so we want that to be about. The, looks like we're going to need to cut this at about two and uh, fifteen sixteenths. We'll just make it three inches. We'll center it a little better. We have to take off more material. We can do that later. We'll go to an uh, 1560. There we go. So, just a little over 8 inches from the other end. Doesn't need to be perfect. You can always square it up a little bit later after after you get it cut. So I will uh, I'll get this all laid out and taped up, and uh, when we come back, we'll uh, we'll start cutting.